pink dot the color associated with the sweetness, softness, and romance may not be a color at all. Or at least according to some scientists who say that pink is not a real wavelength of light, what we see is the product of our wishful brains blending red and violet wavelengths together. Try telling that to my little pony. Nonetheless, we say leave pink alone. And in fact, let's celebrate it. There's no better time to honor the prettiest color that may or may not exist than during February, the month of all things rosy-hued. So we've gathered up some of the planet's more curious critters that come in various shades of magenta, fuschia, coral and rose to pitch some woo. First in the lineup, pictured above, is the most charming salamander in all of salamander world, axolotl, ambistoma mexicanum, also known as the Mexican walking fish. Not only are these amphibians just ridiculously cute, but they never undergo metamorphosis and thus stay in larval form their entire lives. Plus, they have super healing powers that allow them to do things like regenerate limbs. Rock on, Axolotl. A rare albino dolphin that can go from white to pink when it is feeling flushed is pulling in the crowds at a water park in Japan. Although bottlenose dolphins, Terciops, are usually gray, this extremely rare creature is an albino and has no coloration, apart from a tendency to turn pink when feeling flushed. Photos show how the animal is normally white, and occasionally pink when swimming along regular colored gray dolphins. Albino mammals are born without melanin, which gives the color to both eyes and skin, and albino dolphins are extremely rare. In fact this specimen is believed to be only the second one ever put on display in an aquarium after it was purchased from fishermen. And they may well have been doing the animal a favor, as albinos are easy prey out at sea as they lack the coloration to blend in like their gray-colored relatives. Experts said that it was remarkable that the animal had actually lived so long before ending up at the G-Whale Museum, in Higashimuro district in southern Japan's Wakayama prefecture. Controversially, the creature was captured during the annual dolphin hunt in the town of Ji. The town and the hunt was made notorious by the 2009 Oscar-winning documentary The Cove, which shows fishermen herding dolphins into a cove either to be captured for aquariums or killed for meat. It was reported that 1,218 dolphins and small whales were captured there in 2011, though it did not specify how many of those captured were killed. But the rare albino was one that did survive. Since then it has become the subject of a detailed study by the Tokyo University of Marine Science and Technology and the Institute of Cetacean Research who recently published a paper on the fascinating creature.